<laughs> Mommy doesn't have my other camera. Good morning, guys. As you can tell, it is bright and early. My eyes are still puffy. I'm recording on my phone, so if the quality's not that great, it'll change and probably in the next clip. We just got done taking the boys to school. It's um, just about 8.20 right now. So we were running a little bit late this morning, um, but I still don't have to clock in for another 10 minutes. So we're gonna run through the Starbucks line really quickly. We got lucky this morning because there was only, I think like three cars in the line. So it should go fairly fast. The last week um, when I've come to get Starbucks, the line has been super long because we have two Starbucks in the town that we live in and they're pretty much right across the street from each other. And I think the other one must have been shut down or something was going on because this line was super long each day, but we left early enough to where we could still stop and get our coffee. So I'm gonna order some coffee really quickly. And this little lady is still in her jammas. She brought her baby and her blanket. You're tired? And then of course it didn't help because um, over the weekend the time changed, we had to go forward, so. Spring forward, wonderful spring brings less sleep and more allergies. I've been sneezing all night long, so I might sound congested and going like this. I know I know it's annoying, but my eyes are itchy, they're puffy. Ugh, I feel super tired, but this is gonna be another day in the life working from home. If you don't know, I have changed my um, job. I'm no longer working in a dermatology office. I was working in a dermatology office full time Monday through Friday, and I have recently um, taken on another role as a utilization management review nurse. So I am working fully remote 100% of the time. So it's such a blessing because even on these days where I don't feel, you know, like having direct patient contact and stuff like that, or even going to work, it's fine because I'm at home. So I'm gonna order my coffee real quick. Good morning. Can I get two venti iced coffees with white mocha, heavy cream, light ice in both of those? Yes, uh, but in one of them, can I get extra caramel drizzle, please? And then do you guys have the chocolate milks um, in the Horizon boxes? What, baby? Can I get one of those, too? What do you want? Um, can I get a chocolate cake pop if you have any? And that's all. All right, can I get a name for the Justine. Thank you. I don't want a chocolate milk, so I need me and Oh, the chocolate milk. So we have to go to Sam's Club, huh, and get your guys' breakfast drinks. They're all out of those breakfast essential drinks if you guys have watched any of my Sam's Club or grocery haul videos. Okay, we're gonna pay for our coffee and get home, sign in, and get this morning started. It's Monday, so happy Monday. Let's have a great week. This is a day in the life vlog of a working mom from home. Working mom from home? Working from home mom? Day in the life of a full-time working mom, remote style. How about that? <laughs> is that good? No. Day in the life of working mom. <laughs> What did you get? Oh, you dropped it. <laughs> Thank you. Have a good one. You too. Okay, we got the coffee. We're gonna get home and we came just in time because that line is growing getting long. If you can hear Sayla's movie in the background, she's watching Toy Story. She wants to watch YouTube on my phone, but I'm trying to get our morning clips in because I like watching people's day in the life when they are actually from the morning to the evening or like a full day in the life, not starting like, you know, when you're having lunch or something there's nothing wrong with it but I am terrible about getting a full day in the life so I wanted to start it and all I have is my phone I'm using the phone Sayla's watching her movie in the car if you're wondering let me turn her movie down so you can hear me I ordered I don't know if you heard me but I'll put it on the screen again it's a venti iced coffee with heavy cream white mocha 
no classic light ice and extra caramel drizzle. I know it's a mouthful, but it is so good. <laughs> on a quick little 15 minute break I went ahead and prepped my dinner for later right now it's four o'clock so I'll probably be making dinner about 5 30 as soon as I clock out I will be clocking out around 5 30 today since I took an hour lunch and I took that time earlier to prep the dinner I cut up um, I think it was like five pounds of chicken breast and I just cut them into tender size like chicken tender size or tenderloin tenderloin I don't know anyways I cut them into strips <laughs> so I bagged up two separate bags one with barbecue seasoning and the other with some of the McCormick is it McCormick no it's not McCormick I'll insert a picture up here it's the buttery like steak flavoring and I forget what it's called right now but I'm not gonna walk over the cabinet to grab it but I seasoned two separate bags for chicken and then I think I'm going to make some um, potatoes and rice so we'll see if that's what I stick to but that's what I'm thinking in my head right now Um Sayla just fell asleep she took a super late nap today she literally just fell asleep like 3 45 ish probably and she usually takes a nap between 12 30 and 1 30 depending on what time I take a lunch but we went outside to play today during my lunch break so she took a really late nap <laughs> So she's sleeping and the boys just got home from school a little bit ago they're outside playing basketball sorry for this glare from my window you could see Noah's outside playing basketball with his dad it's a little bit blurry okay so I'm gonna finish up work here and then I will catch up with you guys when I get off and we'll make some dinner together I just wanted to share with you guys these cute clips that I took on my break. We went outside, it was such a beautiful day, and we have this little motorbike for our older boys, and Sayla loves to ride on it. And she wanted to play tag, and Dad was throwing her up. She loves to be thrown up into the air, and so I thought this was pretty cool with the slow-mo. I wanted to share it with you guys. Okay guys, it's now seven o'clock. I've been logged off for um, about an hour and a half or so. I'm outside barbecuing the chicken that I've been marinating on the Blackstone. So I'm gonna take you guys outside. It's really dark in here. We have all the lights off, so let's go outside. a side to go with the chicken. We live out in the country and I don't like to use the tap water so I'm going to add some fresh bottled water, add my broccoli in here, and this is the seasoning that I was talking about earlier in the video, the Buttery Steakhouse by Kinders. It's perfect for different kinds of meats and veggies. You see the broccoli there? It tastes really, really good. I actually sprinkle some on after I made my plate too for some extra seasoning. Super delicious. So I'm going to let my broccoli steam. Once that's done, I'm going to go ahead and make myself a little bowl. Instead of mashed potatoes, I went ahead and did the broccoli since I'm trying to eat healthier and still lose a little bit of weight or tone up. So this was just a healthier option for me. And it was actually really, really good. I think this is my new favorite. I'm 
going to go ahead and make everybody else's plate. I just wanted to get my broccoli done and out of the way because I was starving. So mama ate first tonight, but I was actually standing and eating while making everybody else's plate. So, but here I'm going to go ahead and add the broccoli. And I actually went ahead and made this side the same way that I did my own broccoli with the cheese and sour cream and bacon bits and stuff. It was really, really good. My kids didn't have broccoli this night, so for their side, I had some leftover pasta from the night before. So I went ahead and added some pasta to their plates along with the chicken. And here is the finished product. I have to say it was really healthy and super delicious. After dinner, I have to show you guys this. We went to Dee Dee's Discounts a few days ago. It's a newer store in our area and up by the cash registers, you know, they have those stands with all the candy and all the junk and stuff. Well, I came across these and I love tajin and I love peach rings. They had peach rings and they also had watermelon rings. I also got this Mexican candy, it came in a box and it's watermelon and it was really, really good. So if you like Mexican candy or tajin, if you ever come across these, I recommend trying them. Okay guys, that is the end of the video. Everybody is fed, the dishes have been done and I'm gonna go ahead and scrub the sink out and give Sayla a bath. She's still small enough that she can fit in our large sink, so. This is where she likes to take her bubble bath. If you have stayed to the end, I wanna thank you for stopping by. I hope that you will subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys next video.